Right, let's go and have a little look around, see if we can uh, get a bit of loot before we go. Mrs. just brought me a cup of tea, which is very cool. I did say, uh, I don't know, 45 minutes ago, I can't last till the end of the stream. I'm going to have to get a drink, and I didn't bother. She's sorted me out, she has. Scope. Oh, we are primed for an SKS or a. Uh... An SKS or a Mosin. I have. It feels like forever. I know I had an SKS before and we got that kill here and then I died, but I really don't think I've had a re really good run with decent gear, like most of the day. Like, it really, it really hasn't been that way. I had an SKS on the mouse earlier, but then died to the weapon race bug, but. We haven't had a really solidly good run with really good gear for hardly any time. Through my own mistakes or bad luck or whatever, like a combination of the two. The loot dropped outside the front always rings alarm bells that someone's coming back. Shut up! He's just fucking rang the cavalry. Hopefully there's not many zombies left. I don't think there are. Excellent. Right, be a one times six. It is. This is the better one. But that one times four, that's newly added. It's basically this. Oh, look. That I missed. Some of the chat's going, you missed M4 rounds, you missed M4... And I did, you're right, I did. Uh, now, we can... put the good scope on. We'll get rid of that piece of junk. I, I know it's, it's cool to see it. It's cool to have a varied scope version, you know. I like that, but... I don't like the way it looks. I love the one times 6 Gloomy, I don't really get that for Twitch accurately. I get it for YouTube, yeah. Uh, America is my biggest audience share, but it's not much ahead of the UK. Uh, UK are just behind, and then behind that is other countries like, in the top ten, certainly, like in the top five probably, like Germany, Canada and Australia are around about there as well. We put a man on the fucking moon, did you, Dirt? <laughs> oh, uh, Jaffa, yeah, thanks for the heads up. But yeah, I, to be honest, I don't look at the stats. It does affect things a little bit. I don't know about Twitch so much, but... If you had, like, loads of audience in the wrong country, like, that might sound like a really weird thing, but, like, the advertising revenue on YouTube, it really matters. Uh-oh. Do I have an epinephrine? I don't think I do, do I? I'm not running to anywhere where I've got any kind of cover really, but I'm going to just try and put some distance between me and them for now. It's funny, they, they were shooting at me and there was no bullet snaps. Did you hear that? Like. He was sh I was like, he is shooting at me, right? But there was no bullet snaps. I was being shot at, but it didn't sound like the shots were getting anywhere near me. Then he hit. I think it was a pistol as well, but the one on the left was like raising. But he I think he might have been bugged with 
what was in his hands because it wasn't uh, it wasn't giving me any bullet snaps or anything at all, was it? I felt like I hit the dude as well. I don't know if I did hit him or not, but I felt like I did. in the wall. Please tell me there's a gap in the wall. I'm not running that way. I think if I'm running towards them, that's dumb, isn't it? I've got to run this way. Rise, thank you so much for the support. Cheers for the sub, by the way. Very, very kind. Thank you. Cheers for using your Twitch Prime on my channel, dude. Thank you. And they went down to the side there. If I did hit him, he could be quite injured with this gun. This gun's quite powerful. I didn't see him having a vest. If, it, if I hit him in the chest with this gun... He should be close to dead, and so he probably, uh, maybe I missed, maybe I hit him in the arm, maybe I didn't hit him at all, but, uh, I don't know. I kind of want to take the fight. We're near the end of the stream. I've only got another hour. I don't want to die, but I want to kill these guys. You know, they fired first. I kind of think, fuck them, let's give it a go. They may have gone in there. I don't think... It, there was something on the ground, but it looked like a zombie to me. They looked like a zombie on the ground at first glance. It might have been the dude, but I saw one running to the right. And there was something on the ground, but I thought it was—it looked like a Jeff captain zombie. My prime for great content, smiley face. I don't know. I'm, I'm going to run over in a minute and do something really dumb, probably, but... Right, where's there a where's there a gap? Is there a gap? Oh, there's no fucking gap. There has to be a gap somewhere. see a gap. There has to be one. I know there's one a bit further over, but I've gone through a gap this way somewhere. I know, I saw the... I'm going to have to go this way. I can't... Can I... Oh, fuck it. Let's just go this way. We're in the open. It'll be fine. I saw the thing on the ground. I just thought it looked like a Captain Zombie and not a player to me. But, it, yeah, there we go. There's a gap. I don't know why I couldn't see that from over there. Just fucking blind, I guess.
This is not where he dipped right. It was more over there, wasn't it? Yeah, that's a zombie. Is he hitting me with there? That sounds like a fucking scorpion. <coughs> oh no, he is bugged. You've just seen that, right? He is fucking bugged. I don't know what he's shooting me with, but I've got five fucking bleeds. I don't even think I've got the bandages to deal with it. I don't think I've got the bandages to deal with this. How have I got five bleeds? What do I do now? Blood illness? I think his other mate is still alive, so we are in deep shit here, but... I didn't realise I had a sewing kit. I wouldn't have left the bush. The bush. That was dumb. I think my shirt's ruined, dude. I don't think there's any cutting shirts can be done. Holy shit, I can't believe I managed to kill him. I, I really thought I hit him. When he knocked me unconscious with his insane, like, double hit, back to back, that was really good. What, like, whatever he was firing, that was really good. But, like, I hit him in the chest, I think, you know, and he just didn't take any damage. I am in real trouble. I'll be unconscious any second. I'm going to have to just wait it out. Either his mate's dead, or he's licking his wound somewhere. I just can't quite work out where where his buddy is. His buddy might still be alive and hiding somewhere. The other guy is the one that I didn't hit. Sorry, the other guy is the one that I hit, but maybe didn't kill. I don't know what happened to him. Uh, I wills, thank you so much for the support. Embers, thank you for the four months. Grim, Grim Eric, thank you very much for the prime as well. Cheers for the support, guys. Uh, cheers for the prime, Embers. Very, very kind. So this is going to happen until I get red blood. We're until we're red blood. When, when we're red flashing blood, I'm going to keep going on con until I get it back. No, it's not an exploit, dude. We got shot by Amish said with the same thing the other day. It's a bug that happens. Wellsy, thank you very much for the support, dude. Very kind. Thank you. So, I've basically just got to wait until this goes to red blood. Then I'll try and make my way over. I'm lucky to be alive. The, the plate carrier is the thing that saved me. I suspect his buddy's still alive, and we're going to be a, we're going to be a, like sleepy night nights very very soon. He might have a sailing bag. I've got a start kit. You never know. He might have a sailing bag, but I can't really go across this gap to find out. That's just not going to work, is it? 
can't believe I got five bleeds though. That's insane. Uh, Wellsy, thank you very much for the gifted sub uh, to OG Boomer and iWills. Thank you again as well, dude. Thank you. Oh, I don't know if I can do this. I think I'm just going to go for it. I haven't got the patience. He might have a sailing bag. No wonder I like he's made me bleed because it's an MK2. So he was hitting me and making me bleed, but not doing much damage. But what did he shoot me with beforehand then? Because he put me to red health and unconscious. That can't have been an MK2. He must have shot me with the, the IZH rifle and now run out of bullets, I would guess. So his mate must be really injured and he's doing the same thing, like licking his wound somewhere. Maybe maybe he's dead. I don't think so. I only shot him once when we first saw them. I don't know. Headshot wouldn't do this to me with the uh, with the uh, pistol anyway. With that pistol he was shooting, the headshot wouldn't do this much damage. It just wouldn't. It, he had to hit me with maybe the BK-18. And I felt like he'd hit me more than once, but he probably hit me once with the BK-18. No, I think it's the right guy, because one of them was definitely uh, hand state bugged when they were shooting at me. He had a deagle in the holster, did he, a captain? That that might that might have done it. Painkiller, we saw two dudes shooting at me in the first place though. I'm pretty sure there was two, but maybe maybe you guys are wrong. I'm pretty sure there was two side by side. Sorry, maybe you guys are right and I've got it wrong, but oh, the, the alcohol's ruined. That sucks. Right, we're not going unconscious anymore. Not unless the guy comes and shoots me again. I have got no clothes that are in any kind of condition. I 
Uh, yeah, that's not a deagle. Oh, wait, the deagle's got no no mag, I don't think. Yeah, yeah, I don't think he was shooting that. That's him, isn't it? He had no... Yeah, that is him, I think. He had... What's he died to, then? Maybe I shot him from over there. Yeah, I did shoot at two, didn't I? I must have shot him over from over here. So when I leaned and I thought I'd hit one, I obviously had, but there was two and they were kind of in the same kind of place. And this is probably the one that double shot me, you know? The one that hit me twice and knocked me on con. struggle here. I've got so much jump. So yeah, I did kill them both somehow, and that's how one knocked me on Conan. I was sure when he knocked me on con, I hit that guy, and yet he was still there shooting at me. I was like, what, what, what? That's why, isn't it? Because there was actually more than one. Uh, Alright, let's just go. Let's just go away from here. Very slowly. I've got a compass. Potato, oh no. Oh wow, holy shit, look at that. Now we're going to have to make some choices. I'm going to get rid of the shotgun for a start. I might go to the medical tent for saline. I think we really need to be careful here and try and just get away because I think we're going to end up dead. I think that's the, my biggest worry is dying more than anything else. Yeah, the, the, it seems to have no, have no recoil, the USG, but it doesn't seem to have any more higher fi rate of fire, I think. But it has got lower recoil. It, it does seem pretty decent on that front. It's like a like a machine, but I don't think it's one of the guns that's actually had its uh, rate of fire increased. Rogue Irish, dude, thank you for the support. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. I hope you're good. Double red health, I miss lags. <laughs> that was cool. I don't know if I want to loot that medical. Someone said check the, the medical for a saline. That one there. There might be one on the way out. I think there's a medical just the far side of the... the I checked that one there, but I think there's one on the other side of the hangar. We could maybe check that. I am really worried, though. I, I, we're, my, my stab vest is doing nothing other than holding grenades right now, so we might as well drop that, actually. It's doing nothing, right? It's not giving me any ballistic protection. It's just quite, it's just weighing four kilos, so... Might as well drop that. Shit, that was uh, yeah. This one, this one, I haven't looted. It's worth checking for a saline here. My work day is done. <clears throat> Thank you for keeping all of us company and for that wicked double kill at the end. Love Tinky. the streams, dude, and hope you and the fam are doing great. Tinky, thank you very, very much. Hope you had a good day, dude, and uh, enjoy the evening, right? 
thanks a lot for coming along for the for the journey right cheers for tuning in dude i appreciate it man thank you uh, i'm glad we did get that you know i'm i'm glad we went for it and it, i'm glad it kind of paid off although it was somewhat challenging it's nice to get some kills with the with the uh pioneer we've been doing some decent work with the pioneer lately it is pretty good Cheers for the support, dude. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. I don't think I'm going to loot that. I know, I know it's been there the whole time we've been here, but I think it's been looted. <coughs> Excuse me. I feel like that's the one that's been there ages. I could be wrong. But I don't think limping over to a heli while we're red health is a very good choice. I think we'll leave that. Yeah, the click of doom was a little bit worrying, worrisome, wasn't it? Oh, okay. No, that's not right. That's what I wanted. Twat. Oh, come on. Is there any way to speed up rogue gen health generation? Rogue Irish, uh, people believe, and I'm not sure it's right or it's wrong, that if you go prone, you very slightly increase your health regen. I've heard it said, and I've not disputed it, but I never really feel like it notices. The only thing you can really do is get your blood up. Your health regen is slower if your blood is low. So if you're on low blood and low health, if you can get a saline or a blood bag, that will be okay for you. If your blood goes to white blood, then your health regen starts speeding up a little bit. So right now my health regen is slow. Have I ever played any of the Doom games? The only Doom game I've ever played is the very, very first one. And that's it. I played the first one when it came out. I mean, uh, many years later. should not have fired there. So glad I'm firing tracers. That'll really help me. Wish this grass would fuck off. I think we best stop firing now. It's definitely been looted anyway. I really like this scope, Dimensions. It, had, it has its drawbacks at really long range like that, but I like this scope a lot. Hitting a moving target like that, the only shot that was vaguely easy was the first one. All the others were almost, well, not impossible, but you have to rely on a degree of luck to hit like the other ones. Like, if you're shooting at a juking target, he could juke left, he could juke right, whatever, you know. Even if he goes exactly the way you think, you might miss anyway, you know. It's, it's not an easy thing to do. To be honest, I fired more because I don't have a lot of time. I'd rather, I'd rather shoot now and, and die trying than not shoot and then not see anyone for like an hour and then just stop, you know. It wasn't the smartest, because if they know I'm injured, I am done for, right? I, if they hit me once, I'm dead. Uh, if they, It wasn't the smartest, you know, but... I, don't, I doubt they know what gun I've got. I should think they probably think it's better than it is.
Mar marijuana, Mar Marilama, sorry, I, Marijulama. I, I don't trust the, the markings on, on the gun. I've had, I've tried to use those in the past and it's never worked for me. And in theory, it shouldn't work because they, most of the scopes in theory should be set for one particular round. Like, like I feel like the ACOG is set for the 5.56 five, round out of the M4, for example. But if you're shooting a foul using an ACOG, then the bullet markings are not going to work the same because the the bullet drop is different, isn't it? It's, it's, in theory, it will only work for one particular round type, I'd have thought. But uh, I, I don't... I use the ACOG quite often if I'm firing 5.56, five, but beyond that, I tend to range using manual ranging up and down. We, you can definitely play Daisy alone, and you can also, if you've got a mic and you talk, you can meet people to play with, you know. I, during the course of 2014, I met a load of people and started playing with loads of random peeps because of, uh, like, just having a mic and getting involved and you know, talking to people. That is the only drawback. When you're shooting at range, the red dot itself is a bit big, isn't it? When you're shooting at range, it's a bit big. Like, range like that far, it's kind of vague. It's not so easy to hit with. Yeah, you're right. Logan, I, I drink more coffee during... I drink, like, maybe three or four cups of coffee a day and maybe one or two cups of tea. Maybe. Sometimes less than that, but that's about average. Three cups of coffee... Two, one cup tea, probably. One cup, one cup tea. I don't think they're, uh, I don't think they're looking for me. Oh, I'm drinking that. Don't worry, I've not forgot it. Watchful, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm on the ball. I think we're going to try and get to the base that's in yesterday's YouTube video. Do they think they're pretty naked? I think one of them had a uh, had a plate carrier on. So anyone wearing a plate carrier, I tend to think is probably fairly geared. You know, I think the left one had a plate carrier. Guys, I can't see the chat just for a minute. I'm going to have a quick look see how yesterday's YouTube video is going, actually. Doing pretty solidly well. It's second out of my last ten videos. It's doing all right. <clears throat> I, if I were them, I don't think I'd try and cross the field and try to flank. I think I'd just... Uh, wait to see if the dude that was shooting at me tried to cross the field after me and try and just move on, I think. I don't, I don't think I'd be trying to flank that. It's just too far. I actually need to get over there, but we're travelling so slow at the moment, it's going to take me fucking ages. Was it worth the six hours editing? Uh, best spam in the long run, yes. It does. It never feels like it, dude. No, because... Uh, like, the, yes, it's second out of my last ten, but the video that's top out of the last ten didn't require any editing, you know? So, I can get the same results monetarily uh, without editing. But it's always worth it in the long run. I, I fucking hate editing, I'm not going to lie, I hate it. it I hate, I'd much rather stream for eight hours than edit for four hours. I just, I hate it. But, uh, it, it's worth doing. I wouldn't be here without my YouTube channel, and I want to keep doing it. I want to. I'd like to have more time and really spend more time making videos. Now I'm, I am sick, and that could be from the bandage. So I'm going to quickly take one of these and see if we can get rid of that illness. It might require rubbing alcohol. I can't remember if you need both or not. Uh, Siroth, it, it's not as easy as that, dude. It, I, I know with, with this subject about editors comes up really often, but. Without going into the full details, let's just say that for videos like the one I made yesterday, it's not easy to hire an editor. I 
I thought I had uh, in disinfectant or uh, whatever, you know, the uh, iodine. But I've picked up so many different things on so many different lives. I don't know which was which. I picked up some alcohol from one of the dead guys that was ruined, yeah. Logan, uh, most Daisy YouTubers do edit their own vids. Yeah, I, I think nearly everyone does. If you think about people like Tope, uh, Baby Nades, uh, Frankie on PC, you know, they all they all make their own videos. Yeah, nobody's nobody's like getting made. The only one that doesn't is Smoke, but Smoke is a streamer that started on Twitch. He didn't start on YouTube, right? And he's subsequently grown a massive Twitch channel and then gradually grown his YouTube channel from theirs. And it and it's working, but it's really tricky, you know, like. That team up with with Doc, it was uh, it was seven six and a half ish hours of footage that had to be cut down into a video that made sense. And to be honest, mostly all I did was cut it down and watch it back. I didn't do any tricks or anything. I didn't do any really uh, like complicated editing, like uh, or it, well, or not so much complicated, but time consuming. I, I decided not to put music on this one, and time was a factor in that decision. To be honest, but that's really like the six hours is really time to cut it down to what feels like a video to me and then to watch it back and iron out any mistakes or any bits that or any cuts that I don't like. Uh, so the six to seven hours that I spent editing was only to do a real basic edit, right? I am paying someone to edit. Uh, Uncooper's editing me a couple of uh, best of Twitch moments for 20, 2021. Uh, I'm getting that done now, but it's so much easier to collate clips and make a clips video, but to turn seven hours of raw DayZ footage into an hour of something is... It's not something easy to do unless you played the game, unless you played it through or you watched it live. It's really tricky. It takes a long time. I think it might be wound infection, but the uh, t tetracycline should help with that. And oh, it's a cold. It's a cold. We've just sneezed, so it's only a cold. It's not wound infection, so we're good. Bearded Scott, I don't, I don't take notes while streaming. No, I've got a decent. Uh, I'll have like a couple of moments in mind that feel like, like for example, that two kill there. That I'm thinking that could be part of a video. You know, maybe, maybe if I get a couple of kills this week with a scout, I'll remember it, dude. If if it's this week, I'll remember it, and then I can go back and find the scout kills really quickly, and then uh, away I go. You know, edit the video. But uh, equally, I'll have like an adventure in mind, like that run with Doc on Banoff last week. I'll be like, that That run is this week's video. It was the best thing that I can edit into a video. I'll turn that into it, you know. It, it doesn't require a lot of notes or a lot of thinking. It's, it's very much off the cuff. That was the best thing to turn into a video. That's what I'll do, you know. And the cold is gone, which is good. So the tetracycline's done its job. Those guys that we shot at, I would expect them to be in this town or the next town. They're not going to run south. They're, they're going to run this way. God, I'm getting a. See how I'm running, sidestepping there. I'm getting kind of like a. I know it's hard to explain. It feels a bit skippy, like frame wise. You can see it there. Look how jolty that is. They look pretty good to me. I can't shoot at these. These are not. I don't even know if that shot hit or not. It should have hit. I was only ranged to 100 and I ranged... Oh, they, they think I'm the other side. They don't know. They've not managed to hear where the shot came from. I aim, I aim slightly above and, I, and, and they're not that far away. I'm pretty sure that shot will have hit, but I didn't see any blood. 
It's probably more like 200 metres or so, so maybe maybe it wouldn't have hit. I don't know. It's too late in the stream not to take these shots. I, I don't really care if we die. If I do die, it will probably be the end of the stream, guys. But I'm, I don't really want to die or anything. Don't get me wrong. But it, it's too late not to take the chance. As far as I know, they're in there. How the hell is Mo Salah have voted seventh? I, I'm not saying it's right, but I don't think he's top three, and I'm a Liverpool fan. And, and the reason for that is that it's not based on this season. It's based on last season, when Liverpool scraped into third, thanks to mostly thanks to an Allison, the goalkeeper, own, like coming up and scoring near the end of the season. Mo Salah had a decent season last season, but Liverpool weren't that great, and they didn't win anything, you know. So it's based on last season, not this season, right? Neither did Barca, no, but Argentina won a ma won the South American Cup with Messi being the best player. Everybody forgets that. It's as big as the Euros. It's all of the South American teams. It's just as big as the Euros. Maybe not quite so big. Maybe, arguably, you know, you might say, but it's a big tournament with, like, all of the main teams in it. Now, maybe there's more teams to a similar kind of standard in Europe, arguably, but... It's still got teams like Chile and Mexico and uh, Brazil and Uruguay and Argentina and so on. It's it's a big tournament and it's the first big tournament Messi's ever won. So yeah, that that I can see as a an argument for why Salah didn't do it. I don't know where these guys went. They went they probably went in that house and started cowering, but I don't know. They may have gone the other side of the fence and be flanking around and I might be dead in a minute. Cow, cow, not caroling. No. Cowering, cower, cowering. really are blind aren't they they don't have a fucking clue I think that's the one that I thought I had a plate carry but it's that backpack that looks a bit like a plate it's gone yellow health can't shoot them while they're, they're moving around like that and, and rightly so I can't shoot you know we're gonna have to uh oh, where's he going they look like they were running up through the trees and away I don't know got no vest and I'm so injured but we still we still got to just keep on <sighs> 
They're going to be a lot quicker than me. Because they're not injured like I am. It is really framey, actually, at the moment. It seem, it's feeling really framey. Yeah, I'm playing with Joito tomorrow, yes. Right, we're going to put it down to 100 metres. Steve, thank you for the gifted sub. That's very, very kind, dude. Thank you. This is so risky. This is going to come back and bite me on the ass because I'm running down to the road that they're probably going to run along. They have to be... I feel like they're about to give up and start heading north the way they were going, right? Uh, I feel like that's almost certainly what they're going to do. And we're going to end up bumping into them. Like, or they'll end up behind me or something horrendous. Have a, uh, I don't really have a favourite map, dude. I like to play all of them. Well, through the history of the game, it's, it's Chernerous, but... Like, right now, I, there, there's so many cool maps. I've played Iztec, Nomausk, and Banov today. Uh, and Banov has probably been the most fun today, to be fair, but that's just because of the run of the luck in the game, you know. Uh, they all have their ups and their downs. I, I'm glad we've got them all, you know. But through the history of the game, Chernerus is the best Daisy map, I think, hands down. But it's also the map I've got the most hours in, so it gets a bit not so fun, you know. Right, I thought we were following a road, and that is not a road. I need to get onto the road that goes towards Lukov, or whatever it's called. Is there even a road? I, I don't know. I'm starting to doubt myself now as to what way I should be going. I, I think they. I think where we were shooting at them, I think the track is what I thought was the road, but I think the road went round to the other way. Hi Bumble, how you doing? Thanks for coming in. I don't do 24-hour streams third. I used to years ago, but I gave that up as a as a stupid thing, right? But 12-hour uh, stream today, but I am in the last half an hour. Well, coming up to the last half an hour. That's the road, I think. That's the way we need to go. I think we were seeing them on the track, just to my right there, and then they pushed through this hill to get on the road and go north. So, if we get up to the next town, we may well catch these guys up again. I don't really know. I think I saw them behind. Doc, dude, thank you for the raid. I hope you had a good stream, man. Thank you very, very much. Hope you're good, dude. So I think what we saw was them changing their mind, thinking, oh, we can't see him. Let's go this way and, and move on. And I bet they're on, on this road going away. Uh, Gloomy, I don't I do not do 24-hour streams full stop. It's just not going to happen. I'm going to do a 16-hour stream for a, a fundraising charity stream coming up fairly soon. But I, uh, in a couple of weeks, in fact. But I'm, I'm, no, I'm never doing another 24. If you see me doing a 24-hour stream, it's because I'm about a week away from having to get a job back in retail, I'd imagine. I, other than that, I'm never doing one. I, I just don't ever, I'm never going to do another. They're just dumb. They make you hurt. They, they give, uh, we've got the cold back again. They make your legs hurt. You get backache. They, they make it so that you, like, like, barely can walk for three days. They're just really dumb. Doing 24-hour 24, 24 streams is nothing but bad for your health. I'm, I'm never going to do them. Again. I mean, they worked, and when I did them, it wasn't because I was desperate, by the way. It was because they were growing my channel, and I was trying to become a full-time streamer. But actually, I was desperate, now, Shagger, but not but streaming. Stream. Night, Paul and night chat. Devo, you, good night, bye. dude. Thanks a lot for coming in. I really appreciate it, man. Cheers for the, for the support. Thank you for the bits. 
good night, Shagger. <laughs> uh, cheers for the support, man. Yeah, I was kind of desperate, but it wasn't it wasn't anything to do with Twitch. I started doing 24-hour streams because uh, I split up with my now ex-wife and I wasn't seeing the kids every other weekend, so it just blocked out the entire weekend. So I'd work Monday to Friday, stream Friday evening, start a 24-hour stream at Saturday, on, at Saturday lunch, stream till uh, Sunday lunchtime or even Sunday evening sometimes, and then go to sleep and go to work the next day. So it just blocked out the weekend when I was not seeing the kids and I was like coming to terms with the fact that I was living at my parents' house and I was fucking 38 or whatever I was. My kids know what I do, Clumi. Yeah, they know what I do, but they're not... 12-year-olds and 9-year-olds, certainly like my kids anyway, my girls don't watch Twitch. They watch YouTube a lot, but they ain't interested in uh, DayZ and shit like that. They, they don't give a shit about Twitch. They, they're not into it, you know. I suspect they, Twitch is not going to be for their generation anyway. It's going to be other things, you know, but... Geek Stomper, I don't see the point in having my gun out right now. Like, if I see someone, I can get my gun out and shoot. And if someone sees me, there's a slight chance they won't kill me because my gun's not out. There seems little point carrying my gun in my hands right now. I don't think you can catch cold the cold virus from headgear. You can get it from drinking a canteen and whatnot. I'm getting it because I'm ill and I'm not travelling very quick. I think that's why I'm getting the virus. But yeah, 24-hour streams, they're, they're just shit, you know. And the only reason people tune into them is to see how knackered the streamer is, you know. Let's see how much of no sense he's making. You, you don't actually have... I actually, to be fair, I was... At times, I was vaguely entertaining after 22, 23 hours. But, you know, you clearly, like even now, you know, I've been streaming in 11 and a half hours. I'm not as with it and on the ball now as I was two hours, like in the first two hours and three hours. You know, there is a sweet spot, and if you go over it too much, you just it just affects what you're doing. It makes you worse at what you're doing while you're doing it. You know, same as doing anything. You know, if you drive, you can't drive for twelve hours. You have to stop the car for half an hour, stretch your legs, and do something different. You know, like it's really dumb to try and do it constantly. You know. Tech, I don't have the 24-hour streams. They, they don't get saved, dude. So once they're gone, they're gone. Drift, it was definitely a lie. Yeah, my kids don't play Daisy. They're 9 and 12, dude. But you notice how he skips that question. I didn't even see it. Ah, I did see it. I, well, the lockdown kind of delayed it, dude. That's not my fault. Ah, <laughs> <coughs> oh, Wogan was a ledge, right? Wogan was insane. Those guys that we saw before are going to be in this town. Although saying that, they look pretty geared. They may not need to loot anything. They might not bother, you know. They might not bother with the town so much. I haven't got a head torch, have I? Oh, no, 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 no. I haven't got, I haven't got a torch at all. I need to kind of loot. I don't know. Might run around the edge looking for players briefly, but I need a head torch because we're going to be going through the tunnel shortly and I can't do that with no light. I might as well start looting now. I need a head torch. be fair, another little bit of food might not hurt either. Oh, there's some. UMP, what about the UMP? 
UMP in my hand, you probably mean. Yeah, that's actually a decent shout, to be fair. <laughs> you normally see head torches all over the shop, but when you need one... Will we see one? We'll see. There's two parts to this town. We're in the like little bit that kind of semicircles around it. The guys that we were shooting at before could be in the other bit, just down the road there. They may have dropped this stuff. They may have. They absolutely may have dropped this stuff. Kill mice. He's the OG of Daisy. Oh, oh God! I just seen him. There's another one somewhere. We need to move away from that really quick. Oh, that was cool. I can't believe we caught up with them from like yellow, red and then yellow health. What the fuck is that? That's an M16. Right, let's not get... I think that's the guy we need to look for. But I think we should not go towards the shot yet. I think we should try and get a position on the dead body. Oh, look, there he is. Fucking, how do they do it? They always move as you fire. How do they, do you, how many times does that happen? That's not the M16, there's another player. I'm pretty sure he's dead though. He knocked him on Kong. He wasn't wearing a vest. There's more shots. What the fuck is going on? I've killed the two guys, I think. I think I've killed the two, but there's other people and I don't really know. The guy that I killed first has a press vest on and I really want it.
He is dead, right? I, I can't see him. He has to be dead. I think I, I saw him move. What? Did I not finish that guy off? I knocked him on con and then put him another shot in him. Right, ain't got time for this fucking around yet. Let's just go. How the fuck has this dude moved away from there? Where would he go? <laughs> he must be... <laughs> just like hidden in a house somewhere oh no he's there look I think that's him I just missed him clo he's closer to the fence than I thought I think he's th I think he is there fuck me oh come on Got more people to shoot at down that way. I have to say, I think it sucks that you can put a cooking pot inside a plate thing. That that, that kind of blows, doesn't it? I don't think you should be able to do that. Put a cooking pot inside a protector case. They were only kind of like semi-geared, these guys. Right, let's not waste too much more time. He's got a deagle, fuck that, fuck that. Do I have one? Let's get rid of that. Leather sewing kit. I'd quite like it, but not right now. Fuck it. Don't worry about the other dudes. The suppressor is for a modded Makarov that some of the, the some of the modded servers have. That's an M16. This is bait, I think. It doesn't feel like a real firefight, unless it's someone just happily shooting zombies. I can't even see the fucking holster. There it is. I feel like there was probably more bullets to be had there. Now, what a cool result, though. Well, that's the same two that we've been tracking since the heli, I think. Must be close to white health, right? Why am I getting this back again? I, I have just said it must be close to white health, and there it goes. Look. Is 
It's in there, I think. This is like baity, fucking bait face. It really is. Two different guns we're hearing as well, an M16 and a uh, SKS. Using those actually, forget that. Now I can see the building. They're not shooting. I mean, what what luck? It could be a firefight. It could be somebody on the top floor aiming down at somebody. It could be a standoff. Like someone trying to shoot the guy that's hiding in the building up the top. It could be. Almost 12 hours, man. I'm ashamed I missed almost all of it. Premium cutlery. Dude, thank you for the support. Cheers for coming in when you could, though. I appreciate it, man. Thank you. to break. I think this is bait that we were tracking, by the way. I really do, but I feel like they've got in a position they can defend and thought, fuck it, let's, let's bait them, see if we can get them to come our way, kind of thing. And I'm obviously falling for it, but it's the end of the stream. Why not? Oh, the door's there, look, and it's shut. Heard him change guns. He might not even be related to the guy inside, or they might be together baiting, but he could be overwatching trying to get shots on the dude that was baiting in the building, you know? We didn't hear these guns. These aren't the guns that were being fired. He's overwatching the building trying to catch the fuckers that are in there the same as me.
sure there's other things I can get, but for now that will do. I didn't get my uh I didn't get my grenades off the other vest, I don't think, but never mind. He's got a head torch. Actually, that is a good shout. We should get that in a minute, but I, I'm going to be dead soon. I think there's two people camping here with an M16 and something else. And so I'm going to be dead in a minute. I'm not going to turn this down. I've got to give it a whirl. It's it's the last 10 minutes of the stream. Either I die or they do, you know. I ain't got time to fuck around, so the head torch probably doesn't matter. I have got that. Rushing them is not going to work, Chief, too high. Although I probably am going to push a little bit, but... Ru you can't rush this building, dude. It, you, you just die. If you try to push this building, you die. It's... It's in... Oh, okay, you die if you don't as well. I, I don't know where that came from, but now I'm dead. That was a big gun. Where did that come from? Was it the roof? Could have been from the barn. Sounded like a really juicy gun, but it didn't do much damage. I don't know where my UMP is, to be honest. I still have it, though. Oh yeah, it's in the chest pouch. You're absolutely right. It is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't push there, can I? It's just too open. It sounded so loud. Baiting bastard. I feel like that, that barn door was open and now it's shut. The back door is uh, open. Maybe the back door's the one I saw. I don't know. The shots are coming from that three story. The red roof barn was. Yeah. I don't think he shot me from this barn, if that's what you mean, but I think we might go in there temporarily. Hey, does thank you very much for the three months. Oh, fuck, I've come the wrong side. Uh, S-Blitz, thank you very, very much for the support. Grats on the double-double, thank you. <laughs> uh, premium Cutlery, thank you for the 12. JBK, thank you for the support as well.
Oh, that is awful. The view is terrible. I fucking hate people that camp this stair. It really, really sucks. It's actually nigh on impossible to throw a grenade up there as well. It's really, really hard. Like you try and throw a grenade up there, it tends to fall on you. your release. <sighs> Something keeps reinfecting me. It's getting right on my nerves. I've never had a cold so many times before. It's possible I'm more susceptible to catching a cold because I'm permanently, like, low health. They're still in there. I, I still can't quite decide where the guy was that shot at me. I don't think he was on the roof. I think he was somewhere by this hay bale. Or in the barn. In the barn or by the hay bale. Or hay mound, it's not a bale, but... It looks like the barn door closed, it's just because we're looking through to the other barn door is all. Barn door closed. Uh, hit mobile, thank you very much for the support, dude. Very kind, man, thank you. These are, this is so sad. I'm just going to die when I push these, and I am going to push them. We're now at 12 hours, so we're kind of like through the stream, if you like. But <laughs> I'm going to push them. Even if I'm yellow health, I'm still going to push them. But they'll be up in the little hidey hole bit. They'll be up in the stupid sad room, you know? Like We're a long way into the map for these guys to be camping in here and baiting people over, you know? We really are. wanted to say hi and that I've really been enjoying your streams and videos. Keep up the amazing content. Been here for a while already and don't plan on going anywhere. Cool, Love dude. you, bye. Thank you very much for the support, man.
Uh, thanks a lot, Cord Kvazia. Thank you very much for the prime. Some legitimate firefighting been going on. in a grenade. I don't know if I can do this or not. It's, I don't think this is going to work. This will be my death, guys, but I have to do it. I knew it. He was obviously camping. It's so sad, but my only approach to try and do it is there. I can't go up the stairs. There's two in there. I have to try and get up the ladder. That's the only way I could do it, but they can hear me, you know. So it's whether they were all in the shit room on the top or if one was down. And he, I thought one was down, but I, I had to do it. It's the end of the stream. Either I log out and save the character. I don't want to do that. I'd rather give it a try, you know. So, But I had to get up the ladder to give me a chance to shoot. And, and that was that, you know. Anyway, uh, that's it for me, guys. It was the end of the stream. I don't really regret it. It's it's a real shit way for them to play. However, there was two dead dudes down there. Now, maybe they camped them all and maybe they, they baited them. But I suspect they were at one point in a real firefight and then got injured and then had to stay there. But some of what's happened since was clearly bait, you know.